Hey guys, um, I have something to talk about. It's kind of funny in a way. Um, it's about this police raid, alright? And what they did at first, it turned out like this Police Department search warrant, Police Department search warrant, and then it went from Police Department search warrant to this. BAM! And pretty much they went into the house screaming out, Police Department search warrant! And, uh, yeah. After that, they shot the dog and scared the shit out of a little seven year old. I mean, <laughs> really? Why? Why? Why go to a random person's house and knock on their freaking door and let them know it's a search warrant? I mean, nine times out of ten, that guy can have a gun already loaded and aimed at the freaking door at the moment that you slam it down. That's why you gotta put more time into it. Not just go and just knock on, I mean, not just go and just slam the door down. Well, you're not supposed to do that. And shooting the dog, they could sue you. Literally, the dog did nothing wrong. They could sue your ass right there. Trust me. And I already know you don't want to be sued. So don't go doing that. Don't go knocking on people's door and shooting dogs. That's not just how it works. Well, if the dog is growling at you and about to attack you, yes, by all means, kill the dog. But if it's doing nothing wrong, leave the fucking dog alone. And they were doing this for marijuana. Because they thought, they thought there was a possibility that they had marijuana in the house. I mean, really? That is fucking stupid. I mean, something harmless as marijuana. They go in... And then they scream at people, tell them to get on the freaking ground. Whew. Yeah. You should look at your government. <laughs> yeah, your government's probably saying, hey, 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 shh. Just leave that a secret, all right? We don't want them to know that I'm actually planning this. Yes. But when, when people do that, they end up getting killed. For real. I mean, that's how our cops die. Is they go to some uh, druggie's house randomly and then knock on the freaking door. And then once they slam the door down, they always see a man with a hand loaded handgun. Yep. But this man didn't have a gun. But I'm just telling you the possibilities of someone that could have a gun and you go and doing that. And then you'll say, yeah, but we'll be ready. Uh-huh, you'll be ready to lose one of your cops. <laughs> yeah, you'll be ready, all right. But marijuana, that is stupid. I mean, doing that over marijuana... I mean, when we got something that's more serious than that, we got people with crack, cocaine, and everything. Why didn't they stop by the crackhead's house first? <laughs> that's my question. I mean, it's kind of like me saying, Oh my God, the guy's beer! Shoot his dog! <laughs> uh, I mean, that's just... Funny. <laughs> when I think about it that way, because that's what it's like. It's like you go into people's house to find some beer. Next thing you know, you go, oh, hey, shoot his dog. Because alcohol was illegal at one time. Believe it or not, it was illegal at one point. But me, if I was a cop, I would put more time 
and the more time you got, the more safer it is. Because once you can put that more time in there, then you'd be like, okay, this guy has a gun, and we might want to be careful. Because we never know when he would have it aimed at the door. And then after that, after you get that down, then by all means, knock down his door. I mean, if you're going to be doing that to people for just something that is harmless, uh, really, but I already know it's illegal, but still, you shouldn't be going yelling at people and scaring the shit out of little kids. Anyways, that's all I got. And if you like this video, like the video. And if a man comes by and shoots your... Actually, if a policeman comes by and shoots your dog for no exact reason, sue his ass. <laughs> uh.